Good morning and welcome to this episode of A Dad and His Lad. Um, this morning we are preparing some servos, servo mounts for uh, our point control. Um, I'm using the Merg um, 3D printed set uh, available from Merg. You've got to be a Merg member to get these. I think these retail for about six pounds something for six of them um, so they come on a spruce and the piano wire in there is for the um, mechanism we can talk about that in a minute and then just some uh, nuts and bolts um, so I prepared a bunch earlier already I've taken them off the spruce you end up with three parts um, the, the bracket um, which fits like that the this little piece here goes this is quite hard to do one handed let's do it like that and then the servo no, no, the servo mount in the gap and then we put this mechanism on the front uh, it's probably easier if I show you one in place already uh, here's one on the layout you can see the piano wire is goes through the through the board and into the uh, point on the other side um, so I'm going to mount one of these up and I'll come back to you in a sec. So I'm using the Tower Pro 9G digital servos. Um, you can get these on eBay. Um, they're pretty cheap. Um, I get mine from Servo Shop. Um, they're a tad more expensive, but at least I know if I've got a problem with one, I'll go back to them and get them fixed. Um, in the hardware bag, we actually only need Right, that with my teeth. We can get rid of those two horns, and we only actually need that horn there. These screws here, this screw is used to mount the horn onto the servo, and these two screws here are used to mount into the uh, servo mount. So I'm going to get on and do that now. Alright, so here we are. The servo is now mounted into the mount and we can see the mechanism the servo captures into this uh, arm at the top so when the servo swings it toggles the turnout either on or off whichever way and we can configure those throws in our Merg software which I'll do another time 